Hey guys, uh, it's me from the editing room, and by the editing room, I mean our unfinished home. So I re I looked at the footage, and uh, uh, you'll notice the audio in the game is much louder than my voice. So whoops, but you know what? I feel like the story is a good story, and it needs to be told. And I think you deserve the whole story. So I'm gonna upload it anyway. I'm just gonna just disclaimer. It's kind of loud. It's kind of loud. So, my bad. Hello, hello. Welcome back. My name is Connor. Uh, today we are playing The Supper. Um, this is the last part of this game, The Supper. Uh, and then, you know, um, I guess I'll go back to uh, Jump Scare Mansion. I, I did uh, one Halo thing. I was like, I recorded some Halo and uh, I thought I would upload it. Because why not? Because I, I had the footage. Um, but I didn't like the vibe of it, and it didn't really do well anyway. So we're going to go back to horror stuff. Here we are, the supper, okay? Um, don't mind the swordfish. He is missing a tail. Um, I don't know how that could have happened. Um, <clears throat> anyway, so... So we, what did we do? Let's go in here. What did we get done? Yes, so he's dead. The mind controlling fungus. Yeah, he's not hungry. He's dead. He's not hungry. The old man. No, he's not hungry either. Dead, they're dead. <laughs> Perfect, those remain ingredients. Now let's finish the dish. So, that's the voice in my head, I guess, or her head, Miss Appleton's. Um, <clears throat> if you've not noticed, Miss Appleton looks very ill, and it's because she is, I think. Um, I have my theories. <laughs> um, so... Let's give him his dish. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh, I'm missing the. Wait. I need this special sauce. Uh oh. That's sort of a big deal because. Ta da! The special sauce is definitely placed. Well done, Miss Appleton. The hand and tongue stew is ready to be served. Ooh. So now let's do this. I got it. Bon appetit, my cartilaginous friend. Okay. <laughs> oh. oh, there he goes. He's dead. Ah, another satisfied customer. Such a tasty delicacy can't help but defeat even the most discerning of stomachs. I don't know if you guys can hear this, but a big breeze just blew in to, like, the room from my door. It is so windy. Oh my gosh. Uh, well done, Miss Appleton. The service was impeccable. I don't think our customers have any complaints before. This wind is gonna blow my camper over. Oh my gosh. Not any noise in the microphone. Great! Now let's clean all this mess before the stench gets the attention of the authorities. Okay. So what do you want me to do now? Do I go into the kitchen? I don't know what you want from me. Do I want do you want me to pick the knife? I really have 
no idea what you look at me. So, do I open up the chest? Gosh, stuff is going everywhere. Oh. Oh? Oh, what is happening? Oh? Ten fathoms deep on the road to hell. Yo ho ho, and a bottle of. Oh, we got. She's singing as she works. What is happening? We've never used the grinder with such large specimens. Let's hope their bones don't get stuck. Oh my god! I freaking knew it, dude! I freaking knew it! Quote, Well done, Miss Appleton. You performed diligently. I knew it, man! I knew it! What in Hades is happening? Thank you, Miss Appleton. I appreciate all you've done for me. At last, I'm at last I'm allowed to rest. And so are you. I have so many good memories of you, and I, working side by side, you were my dearest friend. Oh no. Oh my gosh! When those beasts dragged me out from our kitchen, I knew I was done for. I swear I didn't steal that gold nugget from them. I want it fair and square. So she ate her legs and she got sick. And he died. While I was anguishing, suffocating inside this chest they put me in, there was only one thing I knew for certain. You wouldn't rest until you found me. Dead or alive. I'm deeply sorry. You had to lose your own sanity along the way. Please, find a quiet place to be- I'm not crying. Shut up, don't laugh at me. Please, find a quiet place to bury my bones. Near the old well where I like to spend time. It's time for me to leave, Miss Appleton. Sweet dreams, my dear friend. Goodbye. God. Okay, this might be the shortest video I've ever recorded, and it might be the saddest. Well, that was quick. I thought there was... Is that it? I thought there was more to this game. Okay. Yo, this is, <laughs> this is such a short video. Bravo, Octavi Navarro! Holy moly! Good on you! <laughs> Jeez. This is so moving. Okay, okay. So there's some. So this is a pretty small team. So editing and proofreading. There was two people that did that. But all the like art programming and stuff that was done um, by a couple other people. Sorry, it got really loud. All of a sudden, <laughs> holy crap! Oh my gosh. Thank you for playing. Okay, well, you know what? Um, Right, support the developer. Give some love to the developer. So they can keep creating games. Listen to the little birdie, okay? Um, and they do. They have a... There is an art book. There, you can buy a book of all the art. So, wow. Well, this was short and a little sad and depressing and a little morbid. Um, but I guess, um, I, 
Pero, eh, 